Hi, welcome. And this morning we were talking on Discord about BSP WM and about uh, so it's desktop, one of the many we have. And we are uh, we're talking about transparency inside the your XVT. So we don't use Thermite there. It was a choice having to do with the BSP WM is and Normally, your XVT is, is just beautiful, right? It just opens up. Yeah, by the way, if this happens, everything is cool. Just press Super X in this case and say log out again. And then the system virtual box in this case says, okay, we have more pixels than I, we think. So that's it. That's all you need to do. Um, so this uh, your XVT, Control Alt T is not termite in this case. It says here it's your XVT. We are now working on 18.10.4, it's going to be released in a few days, and we have this thing here that's there to help you, but con keys in a window tiling manager is, well, not necessary. So we have Casey, and Casey is a girl, and she is written like this, Casey. And Casey kills all the con keys. Quite easy to remember, it's one of the new aliases we've created. So Casey is kill all con keys, it was so long to type, so we made an alias. You can make hundreds of aliases in your bash RC dot bash RC. So the thing is, um, everything looks beautiful, Eric. Why are you complaining? You have here this transparency. You can navigate all these wallpapers. You see through it. It's fine. It's awesome. But what happens if we have this Python pywall shortcut Alt Shift U? It's a beautiful thing, but this happens to your XVT. So how do we fix that? Uh, well, you have to change something. So you have to delete all these things and then super shift return. And you have here the your XVT and it's not named your XVT. It's the X resources you have to go into. Make it a little bit bigger, scroll down. What you need to do is say, hey, please, I want transparency and I want shading. So 56, 57 without the exclamation mark You've got it, all right, save. Now, often it is a matter of logging out or rebooting. So do that if things are not working. So control T, KC, you remember her. Let's kill the conkey there. Alt next is another wallpaper, another wallpaper. And the fun is in this pie wall thing is when you choose a beautiful wallpaper, these are all too dark. So let's continue to go to the next one, next one. And when you press Alt Shift U, then it's going to change all your looks. And as you see, it's still transparent. So transparency is working. Once um, you set these two lines there correctly, then it's, it's just fine. And um, well, control Alt if you do termite, of course, termite will work as well. And it's, it's again this blue thing. So when you press not Alt Shift and U, but Alt Shift and Next, for instance, then you get the next wallpaper. Alt Shift N, and yes, now it kicks in. Alt Shift N, and you see the coloring is applied to whatever is open bash pipes and all that. Don't think I have installed the bash pipes. So it's in the fun directory. Where is our fun directory? Well, simple. You just go to uh, CD. Well, should I go in a terminal? Why should I open a terminal for that? Just go inside bin, main, and here's the fun apps. So all the bash and the radio and all the things, the fun stuff is in here. And uh, the skull, the puke skull is here, skull puke and Pac-Man and Space Invaders. And of course, also the important stuff like using all the cores and deleting LTS kernel or installing the LTS kernel. So do check it out. There is more on this system than you think. So that's how you solve your Control Alt T transparency. Control Alt U. Sorry. So Alt Shift U. <laughs> now, yeah, now we're doing it. So this is a nice way to end the police box. All right. Cheers.